Hi, in this video we're going to show you how easy it is to add a Buy Now gift certificate button and a special deal widget to your business Facebook page. This is great for additional free advertising um, in front of all your Facebook fans or visitors to your Facebook page. So uh, it's a really good thing to do. Uh, it's easy and it's free. So I'm logged into my account here with the Gift Card Cafe only because I need my account number, which you'll find in the top left under your name. Um, but mainly I'm going to work in Facebook, so I'm going to hop over to Facebook. And the important thing uh, to note is you need to be logged in as uh, the admin of the account or your personal Facebook page. Typically a uh, personal page manages a business page, and you'll, you may be familiar with this if you have a business page over in the right navigation if you log in as your personal account you'll see use Facebook as and this is a massage therapist massage by Charlotte um, so that's the business page you cannot be logged in as that otherwise you won't be able to access the app to access any Facebook apps you have to be logged in as either the personal page or the admin um, so uh, let me just hop over and we'll take a look at and this is the best way to navigate to your business page um, without logging in as the business page just to use the search box at the top. So I'm going to show you what it looks like now. And I'm sure you're familiar with this, the new Facebook navigation here. Um, so this is the business page. Here's the navigation. These are the tabs. So we're going to add another uh, or add a buy now button and a special deal widget button here. Um, and these can expand down so there's room to add more you'll see there's nothing there now so let me go back to the personal page and all you have to do is search for our free app and you want to search for the gift card cafe and it's going to come up here and you're going to see uh, this is our business page, so you don't want to go there. But this, is, this under apps is the app, so you're going to click on this. And it's pretty straightforward and easy to do if you have your account number. Let it load up here. Um, so it's just going to ask you for your, your GC, your gift card cafe account number. And again, you get that from your account. So in this case, it's 1087. You would put your account number in here, hit submit, and the account's added and you're going to have two options, add a buy now gift certificate page and or add a special deal widget page. So I'm going to click on the add a buy now gift certificate page and it's going to open another window and here you're going to select which business page to add it to and in this case I only have one here you may have multiple and hit add page tab and you're going to get a confirmation it's been added now what you need to do to activate it is you actually have to go back to that page again log in as the admin or your personal account and activate it and we can do that quickly here and again this is the best way to navigate back to your business page. Just type in the name of it. Go to it. And navigate down here. Okay, you see that buy now button. So that's the gift certificates buy now. So I'm going to click on that. You have to do this once to activate it. And it says you are the page admin. You have now updated your ID. Refresh to load the, the page. I'm going to do that. Let it look. Now, this is what the customer will see. The Buy Now Gift Certificate button that will launch the shopping cart. Because you're logged in as an admin, you're going to see this. This allows you to remove the app from your account, and then you would actually have to remove the button. But what I'm going to do is go back and add the special deal widget as well. So I'm going to type in the gift, oops, the gift card cafe app. 
Let me go back to it because I had the option to add that special deal widget. Um, since it already knows my account number, I'm just going to add, click on this option now. It opens up another tab or another window. Again, click the business page you want to add to, add page to tab. And there you go, it's been added. Now, since I already added the buy now button, I don't have to go in and um, activate this page, but I'm just going to go show you what it looks like. see here the special deals uh, page and I'm going to click on that and you'll see the widget that loads there um, and again same thing if you're logged in as the admin you have the ability to remove or reset the app and once you do that it actually resets both buttons um, and then you would have to add them again but you know what I'm going to do I'm going to go back to the home page of this business page I'm going to show you how to uh, rearrange these buttons because I really want to have this front and center so you need to expand and then I want to move these buttons up so I click edit and this is also where you would uninstall after you reset the app if you do want to remove these for any reason and I want to say I want to switch positions with the like button so I get it there and then I'm going to do the same thing switch position with the like in order to get my buy now button and my special deals front and center so it's the first thing customers see um, and I think that's important for, for advertising and letting people know um, and again this is also where you would go if you wanted to remove these buttons um, uninstall app but then you still need to reset the app if you want to add it again um, so that's it if you have any questions uh, give us a call or shoot us an email